All right, everybody. Welcome back to Monster Prom. Here we are with the next part of the of the of the. Of the well, Jable's game. going first. Jable's and, going first. And tripping over we're, his words. We're doing randoms. Listen, hey, we both right. do that. Sure. Um, sure. I have the sheet. What do I do with? The, oh no! No oh, no! You went to school. I clicked. Oh no! All right. Probably isn't gonna like you because now you're smart. I'm smart. <laughs> uh oh. Maybe an effect That will day happen. you listen to your elders and learn valuable uh, lessons. I, like a nerd. Oh, what am I supposed to do? Mm. Like a nerd. That's embarrassing. Sometimes after the monster nonsense and dating gimmicks, <laughs> you forget that attending class is supposed to be the primary activity at this high school. Sure. You gain two smarts. Polly isn't, isn't is going to remember Suddenly that. Suddenly she hates me. You spot Miranda and Scott in the vicinity. Oh. It seems like the perfect opportunity to test your new blanket. Okay, good. You wear it as if you were a goofy ghost and approach them with a big, with a spooky woo while Miranda is explaining something to Scott. And that's why those treacherous air people are the absolute worst <laughs> and also most likely tied to the disappearance of Mars Argo. All right. Oh, what's this? <laughs> a ghost? Perhaps a foreign exchange student? What are you talking about? Oh, gasp! It doesn't say he gasped, he says I'll gasp. You keep saying things out loud, you big nerd. I didn't see that, so ghostly. And you guys are joking, right? This is clearly just Jables wearing a blanket with eye holes cut in it. Jealousy is a powerful drug, Liam. Do not become addicted. Yeah, Liam. You got to see what's saying, oh, Liam is really just Jables wearing a blanket with eye holes cut into it. <laughs> Exactly, Liam. Even despite the many times we suspected it at the cell. It's my secret identity. What? Oh, sorry, little ghost. We were ignoring you. That's true. Tell us, do you have any cool ghost powers? Oh, yes. Divulge, divulge. Do you get high <laughs> yeah. on everything? Yes. Basic ghost knowledge. Ghost's main power is levitating stuff. Ultimate ghost pranks. Haunt someone into despair. Obviously, pranks, right? Pranks are fun. Maybe. Yeah. You spot a victim for your prank, <gasps> the coven. <clears throat> uh -oh. You start running into in their direction while screaming your best boo to date. I'm very cool. What? what? Damn. What, what's this? Huh? Yeah. Huh? I mean, the one on, like I said in mine, the Can't one on the far that, left yeah. is the cutest. Maybe it's a minion of Queen Nella H Helenia. Rumors say she's preparing to be the big bad of next season. Stop booing at us. It's hard enough to save the world on a daily basis. We don't need people here undermining our morale. Stop booing! The school is unbelievable! Oh. <laughs> they go running, looking for a place to recover from all the booing and undermining. Undermine them, it's true. Whoa! The ghosts clearly haunted them, and they have fought against all kinds of evil creatures. Such a powerful ghost. <laughs> so cool. You just ran at them while booming. I could literally do that. Yet you didn't do it, Liam. Therefore, you're not a ghost. You're just jealous. Yeah, it's a very powerful ghost. Ghost, we respect your ghostly powers and we wish you the best of your ghost adventures. You leave, running and booing, before they realize how obvious is that you were just with it was just you with a blanket. Today you gain two boldness and one smart. And that was my event, huh? Let's go. Your corpse one was more fun, but Zeph, yeah. let's go. What do so you want to do? You're gonna be bold as heck, dude. Be what bold. Oh no, the shopkeeper was there! The shop, get wrecked. Can you leave the shop and choose again or are you locked in now? I'm, I'm you locked have no in. Money. You can look at my stuff. Yeah, you have no money though. You can I, I can buy the gift that the keeps, gift on, keeps giving on giving for no reason. It does say you can exit. If you want. Yeah, but it won't let me do anything. Yeah, you take gifts, man. Mm. Or do you wanna? Hmm. No, I'm just gonna buy the gift. Do you even know what's in it? Is it a rando gift? See, or? I'm wise enough to know what a gift needs given. Yeah. <laughs> That's a song. <sighs> Suck my jingle. Bells. I got a lot of charm, but no boldness and no. Oh you no! Lost fun. I'm you lost fun. fun and boldness, but you got a lot of charm. It, it's, it's just as fuck, but form over function, bitch. Damn, you got hit hard in the fun. No, and you lost both. My fun. But you're super charming. I'm super charming as fuck, but uh. I, don't, I don't know if he likes fun or not, though, or uh. if he likes charm. Let's go. Let's go. You're engaging in your favorite weekend activity. 
ignoring anything in favor of thinking about which classmate you like to take to prom and how horny you are. When you find out this is apparently one reading does. on your face. What's that? Hmm? You... I said as one does. Uh, yeah. Hey, Zach, you seem pretty horny and like someone who sits around all day thinking about who you're going to take to prom. Talk about me, you gorgeous ghosty. Wow. Did oh, she wait. have your number or what? Listen, oh, does she have your number or what? I'm kind of interested in someone, but honestly, I don't think I can play with any monster who isn't spectacular at sex. You better talk about my sex skills to her. <laughs> you know sex isn't everything, or I know sex isn't everything, but it's sort of everything to me. <laughs> Not really, but it's pretty high on my list of priorities. Okay. It's right on her drugs. Sorry if this is a TMI. Titillating monster interaction. She never winked at you. <laughs> but it's someone you know, and I thought you might just have some insight. It's Jables. I just love sex. Any position, missionary, cargory, apocalyptic, upside down nightmare demon, the pentagram. Ooh, the pentagram, classic. What do you think? Could Jables keep up with me? Say she couldn't keep up with me. I can only say this. He is the discoverer of the orgasm. The whole thing is named after him. You ever notice that an orgasm is an anagram of Jables? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Once I asked him what he thought sex was about, don't ask me more. And he told me that it was the natural process for most living things to conceive children. He has no idea. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll be nice. Tell her I came up I'm, with the orgasm. I'll help you out. <laughs> Jabba? Yes, the heart. <laughs> orgasm? She is dumb. Oh, Jay, you're totally right. I've never even <laughs> noticed that before. I invented the orgasm. Like, actually, it still makes no sense at all, uh, all to me, but I'm going to assume it's because I'm high and I'm super legit on the level. <laughs> you seem like you know your letters and words. I'm sure it'll make sense once I sever <laughs> up, I which is that. like, never. Jables invented the orgasm in. Eh? What? Yeah, demise. Eh? I am a fan of going straight to the source. I only buy opium from the dude who first discovered it. Being dead rocks. <laughs> it sure does, doesn't it? The important thing is Jables, aka orgasm, totally owes you one. Not just one, not one orgasm, just a general one. You know what I mean. And you gain three fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm no longer you're, negative fun. <laughs> you're at one again, yeah. Player order is decided based on who is most likely to be hiding corpses in their basement. You literally you, you, have a corpse. I, I have a corpse, but I think this is player oh, based. Oh, player wise? Yeah, it's player wise, you. Probably, yeah, alright. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, yeah. It's like, I don't think this place has a basement. <laughs> yeah, sure. I made a basement. I dug it out. Um, sure. Um, sure. Maybe I want to get a present. I mean, I'm gone. Maybe. Well, I mean, I, I, I bought one because I accidentally. <laughs> I want some more fun. Yeah. Uh. That day during recess, you start a half hour of rave that goes full crazy. Is that what's happening here? I'm just, you know, you're, you're doing the Egyptian, but also kind of dabbing. Yeah. At one point, Juan, the small magical Latino cat, slips on a banana peel. You start left to laugh at him. He asks you to stop, but you don't. You laugh so hard at him that somehow he's still too fun from him. Hooray! <laughs> you okay there, James? I almost spit up my drink. <laughs> you just laugh so hard you steal too fun from him. All right. <laughs> then you realize you're feeling like huh. going full oh. ghost with your blanket again. More? Oh, there's more. I thought it was just like a one-time thing. You're observing your surroundings when you spot Miranda and Damien. Oh, yes. You're not running into Polly anytime soon. They, well, yeah, but I can still mess with your boyfriend. You're about to get closer when suddenly... <gasps> Greetings, beautiful high schoolers. It is I, the interdimensional prince. I'm here to rescue you from your mundane existence. Just sign these marriage papers. Not this guy again. Look! Whoa! Oh, gasp! <laughs> An underworld specter! <laughs> this again? What again? Look at him. This is clearly a kick ass, powerful ghost. Look at his face. So deadpan. No expression at all. That's because it's not a face, it's a sheet with two holes cut in it. Man, I wish my face had two holes cut in it. That'd be fucking metal. That would. <laughs> <laughs> no, listen, it's not a face, it's... Ghost friend, help us. Save us from this interdimensional creep. Yeah, do something. Something ghostly. Boo. <laughs> or throw a rock at the interdimensional prince. Uh, I mean, boo worked last time, right? That's ghosty. It worked last time, throwing, but also throwing, I'm not allowed to give you advice. Yeah, throwing a rock isn't ghostly, but booing is. Mm -hmm. Okay, You're not I creative. wasn't so creative. Hmm. Uh, yep, yep, that was your entire plan. Entire plan. 
ghost friend, we no. asked for your help, not for you to share your ghostly thoughts with us. Right. There is time. There is a time to boo and a time to act. Give me a chance. I should never have expected a ghost to save us. He is not a ghost, goddammit! You're not helping either, Liam. You leave the four of them to solve their own trickery, trickery non-consensual abduction situation while you reflect on your ghost skills. So am I going to lose creativity or something? Could it be that you're not a good ghost? You thought that oh. wearing a blanket with two holes cut in it was enough. You lose two smarts and one creativity. Alright, I don't need to be smart for Polly. Let's go. Your turn. Let's go! Okay. So he's... You want boldness? Yep. Uh, she's not there. Yep. So I'm <laughs> safe this time. That day you visit the bathroom to take a number two. Third time going to the bathroom. Today. Yep. Don't worry, there won't be an illustration of that specific moment. The thing is, you make one of the boldest decisions in your life. You don't put paper on the toilet seat before using it. <gasps> Scandalous. Look at you, you crazy bastard. You gain two boldness and probably one staff of the caucus with a slight chance of one STV. Oh no. Damien. After your previous adventures, now corpses are acceptable and quite hot fashion accessory. Mm -hmm. You become a well-known trendsetter advocating for your beloved corpses. Life is now all fancy and busy. Luckily, you have your sexy, sexy secretary to help you with all your new tasks. Miss Zeph! <laughs> oh no, he's my secretary. <laughs> if you had assumed your sexy, sexy secretary had to be female, then shame on you. Oh no. It's been leaked that Vogue's next issue will include an article titled 10 Reasons Why Wearing a Corpse as a Fashion Accessory is Not Chic and is also probably a crime. Kill the Vogue writers. <laughs> I've done some research and found the journalist. It's a bro called Fedor Fedora. Shoot him in the fedora. Well, what should we do, boss? As Vogue rules dictate, the only way to subdue a Vogue journalist is by out journalisming them in a journalism duel to the death. Or, sometimes people need a little push in the right direction. Kill his family and send him their severed heads mm. as a warning. I like this the second one. Kill his family? Yep. Send them their heads? Alright. No, no, not both! Way to go, boss. Nothing like a friendly reminder to show people you care. Who are we scheduling murder in your agenda? You keep Scott out of the murder because he's too pure for that. Mm -hmm. You take care of it yourself because you're a responsible young adult that can take care of her own murders. Soon after murdering Fedora's parents... Boss! Boss! It worked! The Fedora bro changed his article! Read! The other day I woke up to an unexpected surprise from Zeph, the well-known trendsetter and corpse advocate. Zeph murdered my parents and sent me their severed heads. So unoriginal. It seems she thinks corpses are the solution to everything. It's no surprise her fashion is starting to get old. Darn. Also, isn't murdering my parents like a crime or something? Just saying. No. Oh no! Corpses are definitely dead now! Maybe they always were, Scott. Maybe they always were. And yes, that was totally a crime. Police come looking for you and punish you by criticizing your unoriginality, causing you to lose two creatures. I have negative money! They also make you pay a fine so you lose one money. You have one fun and minus one money. Let's trade places! Everybody chooses a brand. Say your choice out loud to the rest of the players before picking. Uh, Jables Wafels. Uh, an Angelic that's, Pretty. That's my brand. <laughs> L Lush. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag please sponsor. Player order is decided based on how likely it is that the selected brand secretly rules the world. What was yours? Angelic? Angelic Pretty. It's a Lolita brand. Or Jables Wafels. Mm -hmm. I'm not there yet. I, I can see I angel angelic pretty. I think it's more likely, yeah. You get to go first this time, finally. <laughs> For once. And we'll start it up on this next episode once we start here. Let's go. Let's go. Next episode, we'll see you guys there for more Monster Prom. Bye-bye, guys. Bye. 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 Bye.